Hello again, beautiful ones. We're going to do something a little bit different when it comes to a mass reading today. And I want you to choose a number between 5 and 10. I'm thinking of a number now. And remember, it's not about guessing which number that I'm thinking. It's about finding the number that resonates with you so you know if this reading is for you. Now pause it if you need to and go through each number from 5 to 10 to see which one is just speaking to you. And now I am going to announce the number. Again, pause if you need more time, but the number is seven. If you chose a seven, chances are you're at a point where you're feeling unfulfilled about something inside yourself. Not necessarily uh, things around you per se, but going back into the past, how things could have been different if this happened, or how you could have done this, or you know, all the coulda, woulda, shouldas. All those things coming up that could have been different. Um, and this is leaving you feeling unfulfilled. Like you should have accomplished more or you should be at a different point right now. Or, you know, just kind of going through all those motions. If you find yourself in that space, remember that's the past. And all those things that you're thinking of in the past, bring it up to here and use it to move forward. Because now is a time to kind of go over all those things and give yourself a second chance. Because I, I think that it's not really about kind of, um, you know, beating ourselves up over the things that we have no control over. But finding a way to go forward. And sometimes we forget that we do have more power in this point right now. Sometimes in the past we live in it so much that we forget that we're not a child anymore. We have choices. We can change things. We can bring a new um, a new air, a new energy to things. We can make those decisions for ourselves. And for some, it's going to be a little bit more complicated and difficult, especially if you're in a situation where you don't have certain freedoms. So finding a way to make those changes and come out ahead. That's where it's at. So every day we can make those changes. And another thing to consider too is if we're not where we want or need to be in this exact moment, what can we do to shift that energy and start changing things and opening up the way for something new? Because nothing happens overnight. But if we get so stuck into the past, we're not making those changes now to go forward. So all those things that we think, if things were different, I could have had this. Things could have been this way. We have it within ourselves to start right now to paving that path.